Uh, it has been a dream, uh, an awake dream, doing uh, a bit more than 10 years. And uh, I couldn't dream about finishing another way. Of course, I miss the fans, but uh, you know, when I started Biathlon back in the forest in uh, the Pyrenees Mountains in France, it was no fans, and uh, you, it was just that love of, uh, of biathlon and on, uh, of, no, of skiing. And I'm proud I achieved all I did, and uh, proud I, I discovered myself along that journey. And uh, today is uh, just a beautiful uh, way to, to finish it. Le roi est mort, vive le roi. And I realized that I did not build my career uh, when it was easy. So I decided to fight even uh, for a top 30, then for a top 20, then I knew that the uh, top 10 was possible. And finally, I, uh, I reached the top 5. It was my answer to him. Uh, yesterday I wrote on uh, the Norwegian press that Emil told that I was afraid about the Norwegian team. And uh, I have a lot of respect for both of them. I know how good they are because they show it every weekend to me. But I don't fear them like they don't fear me. Today it's a really big satisfaction on my side to be back uh, on uh, this position uh, after one uh, really difficult season. So yeah, it's uh, really emotional tonight. Uh, it's uh, inside, calm, but uh, really satisfying. place and winner of the IBU gold medal the world champion gold medalist and Olympic champion representing France Martin Foucault Martin Bocard, who's trying to stamp his authority on this one. He always finds a way, and each time it's different. Martin Bocard keeps the pressure on. Martin is putting the battle on level in, in the skies. Uh, it's hard for us to follow. You have to just respect uh, Martin. He is the battle on God.